get right into this reading, guys. Okay, um, so I do want to give a big shout out also to Lawanda. All right, she did just get this Miss Cleo deck. She contributed that to the channel off the Amazon wish list. All right, um, if you do want to contribute to the channel, you can definitely do that on the Amazon wish list, guys. Um, it's a million and one things to choose from. Also, um, you want to book a personal reading it's also down below but we're going to go ahead and get right into this reading because i was doing today's friday while i'm filming this by the way um i was going to do a lot tonight but it was really really dead for some type of reason i don't know why it's never been that dead but um i just went ahead and turned it live off like i was not even gonna deal with it okay um i just decided to do a reading for y'all because shit i might tonight as well um so, I don't know why, but I'm being really compelled to do a reading for y'all right now. Okay, but the only thing is that I am going to be using the Miss Cleo deck this time. But first things first, Spirit is telling me to use a different deck first. Let's go ahead and start with the Cannabis Oracle deck. Okay, if you are a smoker, hey, hi, how you doing? Okay, but if you're not, you know, still stick around. Once again, it's for Aquarius placements on some of my... Can't even talk. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Mars, and Mercury. Everything you need to know about me. Contacting me or anything like that is down below. Okay. Um, or tipping or, you know, um, adding me on the pattern app or anything like that. Also, check out my second channel. I did just upload two channel messages on there for all the placements and all the signs. When Ashley Lord's Edition, I will be uploading on there all this week. So, make sure you're getting on there. Okay. I'm getting in a more consistent schedule as well for there. So, what is this message about for the Aquarius? placement so we have the temperance card heavy Sagittarius energy okay so cheese okay this is the cheese strain okay and it says step by step you go patiently you find your balance in the right solution okay and then we also have the death card which is scorpio energy lemon cake and it's a sativa all right and it says everything is temporary there are ends and beginnings and in between there is a transformation embrace it okay so embrace something you're going to find the solution here Okay, but, you know, karma is going to fulfill itself. Balance is going to fulfill itself. But we're going to go ahead and see what the fuck is that about. All right, I'm going to go ahead and pull one card out of the shadows of light and dark. All right, and see what this is for you guys. Of course, like this video. So, clean up time. Something needs to be cleaned up. 555, five, five, you could be seeing that, okay? Yeah, but this is all about cleaning up, you know, making something better and having a clear solution presented at hand here, okay? And healing okay this is these are the this is what's on the menu okay anyways i'm gonna go ahead and pull my chair over here with my cards in it all right y'all give me one second and then we have the drake song playing called know yourself you guys probably can't hear it because it's so low i don't want them to copyright me or you know youtube be on that funny shit um but yeah y'all we're gonna see what's going on so we are gonna Pull some cards here and see what is this reading going to be about. All right, like this video, comment down below as well too. All right, so we have misunderstanding or something that's misunderstood. All right, um, a line out the door. I don't know why I'm hearing that song by Rihanna. You are the one that I think about all day. Your love is my love. My love is yours. I ain't heard this shit in a long time. Baby, I something, 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 something all the time. Because you know how to bring me back. You know, you know. And then she goes and she says, you know how to keep me away from running, from running from you. Something like that. So I feel like this is about you, Aquarius, Okay. Okay, so crabs in a bucket. You could be going through some type of transformation right now, some type of transition, change, transformation, or I'm getting new, something new being presented towards you here. I'm going to get six cards. I may do nine, depending on how everything feels. Local news. Consider local news is involved here. This could be the news on your TV or I'm getting social media, word of mouth, you know, shit like that, like, you know. Somebody could be watching Cash 21. We have not seen things clearly and clearly because this card needs to be rewritten. Okay, I don't know why the fuck it look like that. Yeah, and then we have child abuse. Let's get three more cards here because this is going to be a very interesting message. <laughs> and I keep hearing Drake say, you know how she go. We got the industry here. Okay, so either you could be a celebrity or in the industry or whatever it is. We have Snow White. Okay. 
Then we have I Don't Know What I Want. Okay, and I'm getting the Kelly Uchi song from back in the day when I first discovered her. And it goes like, one door open and another door close. I'm paying, that's the way that it goes. That's why when I'm about to turn the corner. Yeah. I forgot how the rest of it go, but Kali Uchi, she's a Colombian um uh artist. Love, love, love her. Okay, so Aquarius, let's go ahead and get into it. We're gonna use the Miss Cleo deck. I definitely see right now there could have been some type of misunderstanding here. I'm getting Okay, so transition. You could be in this energy where you are changing, you are going. I'm getting like there could have been a misunderstanding going on. Or people were misunderstanding who you were, what you stood for, um, what you were about, or all in all, just you know, your emotions. Or also there could have been some type of something that somebody tried to say that you betrayed them here. Okay, or somebody tried to say that you did something to them, either you betrayed them or they must have understood you, or somehow I'm getting telephone vibes for the telephone game. Somebody was telling a story, telling something about you, or was perceiving something about you. This could be one person or a group of people, but I feel like you know that shit is just being destroyed or it's been dismantled. Okay, the word dismantled is very um significant here. Okay, somebody could also have a fireplace. Um, um, but yeah, spirit of the cat. I feel like people are very curious about you at this time. Getting like also, um, somebody could have tried to depict you as something or somebody here who was you know uh. Uh, you know how they say that freaks come out at night? You could be like a freak, either really, really nasty or getting really, really freaky or weird here. Or people could act like, you know, you're very high class or, you know, how do you say you're a loner? Whatever it is, but, you know, you're just independent. So there was a misunderstanding about who you are, okay? Um, or there will be a misunderstanding. Either this is this already happened, it's happening now or will happen, you know, past, present, future. These are timeless. Feel free. Also, if an old reading pops up on your page and it's one of mine, there could be a message in there you need to know regardless of when it came out. Yeah, but I feel like right now, I'm getting, you learned a lesson here. I'm getting, people learn some type of lesson regarding to you. I feel like what somebody did was purposely try to misconstrue or make you look like the bad guy or paint you out to be something or somebody you're not here. But the same group of people here, they they have gotten the wisdom or they've came to the conclusion of what the fuck is going on here. Yeah, I feel like with the sun card, they're finally seeing your true light, your true form here, or you're being resurrected, or you're being, um... Um, not resurrected. What's the word I'm looking for? It starts with an R. Um, oh, I can't even think of the word, but you're being brought back to life. I feel like you're being renewed or renounced or, um, word right now. Like it's, it's something like that. Okay, you're being brought back to life or whatever it is. And it's so funny. We have the song by Drake playing called Jaded. So I feel like somebody could have um, been jaded. Or I'm getting these group of individuals or person or people were jaded here. Or they listened to somebody who was jaded about you. Okay, and this ended up having some type of misunderstanding um, coming for you here. This could definitely create some type of heartbreak or breakup or situation. Or it really could have hurt your feelings here. Whoever this person who was jaded, I'm getting like, you hurt their feelings here. This is why they did this. Okay. They want people to be on their boat of misery, but I feel like you know, at this crossroads here, okay, um, you could definitely be a divine feminine or you're in your divine feminine energy here. I definitely feel like you're at a crossroads right now, Aquarius, because whoever this person is who made this misunderstanding, and it's so funny. I have the page of swords at the bottom of the deck. This person was definitely talking shit or acting funny, moving funny here. Whoever this is who tries to bring up this misunderstanding about you, yeah, I feel like Eight of Swords, they're having to bow down to you here. Or they're in some type of mental prison or they're having to, I feel like they're jaded here, but they're having to face their own demons or face the reality or the actions or the karmic debt that they have incurred here by doing this. Okay, um, I don't know why I heard you will be hearing from this person really, really soon or you will be hearing from me. You know how somebody says you will be hearing from my lawyer. I feel like you could have definitely sold this, um, you could have definitely, if you wanted to sue this person for defamation of character or could have took some type of legal action here, this person could definitely be in the legal system either they've been there before or they could possibly work for the legal system or whatever but i feel like queen of swords energy um you they're in your energy right now so i feel like queen of swords you have to say so yeah Nothing may not happen regarding courts, but whatever this misunderstanding is, I feel like they have to go up, uh, up towards the spiritual court here. I'm getting Knight of Cups. They have to plead their case, and it got denied here. This motion was denied. Eight of Cups. I feel like also this person could have been praying here, or uh, with the Eight of Cups, this person could have been trying to act as if, you know, somehow, some way, what they were saying were truthful. But I feel like one thing about it, they were being watched by the ancestors, or this wasn't going their way because it just it, it was not true, or it was one sided. I feel like now you have a line of people out the door wanting to kiss your ass. Yeah. 
or you're about to have a line of people out the door this could be people who want to talk to you be around you be your friend um or trying to stop you for a minuscule conversation or get the tea on you yeah spirit of the flock we do the same people here they were working with this person who who purposely uh uh gossiped about you or made you a rival or somehow created this posse but like kanye west says they love you then they hate you and they love you again i feel like this is this message right here i'm talking about this is for somebody here who's either up and coming like celebrity dancer writer um actor singer something that you do is in the fucking industry either you can be in the music industry you could definitely be like working for you so you could be a reader like me you can be actual a uh, celebrity you can be an actress okay an actor you know some type of entrepreneur of some short you know be a model a dancer Whatever Whatever it is, you're in some type of high money making, high volume, high quantity, um, high attention industry here. But I feel like this was a test, or I'm getting this was a test for not only you, but these people, and they all failed. So they'll be going through some karmic debt as well, too. But I feel like you have a line at the door if you do own your own club or business or whatever the fuck that you own. It could even be like a place that you own or somewhere you go to or you reside at okay or somewhere where you're going to be at people are, are going to definitely be flocking to that area so be careful to sharing your information or sharing where you're going at this current time being here i feel like the spirit of the child yeah i feel like now people are viewing you um as somebody who's like a child or you look really good or you have i'm here you're glowing your skin is amazing or i'm kidding i knew you weren't that way i just couldn't figure it out why i couldn't figure it out before okay yeah also i feel like people could also be viewing you at this current time being as somebody who's innocent or you had nothing to do with it or i knew that wasn't true or i knew something wasn't right or you know whatever it is or something i'm getting much better now people are understanding that yeah also i feel like if somebody tries to betray you as immature people are saying you could definitely have a very uh jovial energy very nice very um understanding um definitely a lively energy but at the same time you do mean business okay you can have an adventure as well too where you know how to have a good time all right and i'm not talking about like sloppy drunk i'm talking about have a good time i'm not talking about you know overspend or be sloppy drunk or you know embarrass yourself or you know public disturbances whatever the fuck it is somebody had to make a misunderstanding about you your character what you stand for or i'm getting what you did to somebody there could have been also an allegation here but whoever this person is was like an egg for somebody who hurt their feelings unintentionally or i'm getting they took something personally here but i'm getting this is all for show this is all for the cameras or this was all for you know person could be a scorpio does not have to be or an air sign a war sign or air sign but i thought like this was all just for show or for their own game or whatever yeah delusion this person's fucking delusional here i'm getting they had people under their delusion or their spell like one okay this person could be a pisces or a water sign or air sign specifically these are the ones that deal with the mind the dream state you know if you um are watching this go ahead and check out the aquarius and pisces placement aquarius dealing with pisces reading okay uh but yeah like i said you have a line of people at the door right now but it's like these are the same people who talked about you or made you feel indifferent yeah but in particular the temperance here they could be a sagittarius i'm getting all this balance all this fear and love and war okay that's what i'm getting here but the all these people here too of swords i feel like they were more afraid of you than you are of them or they couldn't really see the truth or um it could also you were being secretive here or they had some type of tea or secret on you but turns out it happened to be false or something like that or it was portrayed or poorly it's giving telephone vibes let's say somebody says oh he's wearing a black hat the next person says yeah they're wearing a dark color hat the next person says yeah they're wearing a hat and the next person says yeah they're wearing a hat i don't know what color it is it could possibly be pink and then you get back to the next person they're like oh my god this person's wearing an orange hat with ribbons and stuff on it and then that's not even what the fuck he was wearing he's wearing a black hat something like that yeah, I just like to us awards. These people could have been intimidated by you here. I'm getting whoever this person was, they were intimidated or scared of you here or couldn't face you. Or emotionally, they could have been unavailable to you. Or I'm getting they were very secretive here. But the person in question, I feel like they are a fucking fool. However, you are the fool card here, Aquarius. So, I mean, um, it doesn't get more foolish than you. I'm getting they're trying to, they tried to knock you off a cliff, but somehow you still survived or somehow you still managed to uh, take the blow. All right yeah i just feel like whoever the fuck did this yeah tower card this is a tower for them and everybody involved here but i feel like they, they were all the way at the top here leading everybody leading the blind so they get the worst fall the most karmic debt to pay back of them all but yeah devil card this could definitely be in a capricorn as well a air sign a, a, or a water sign or a capricorn we got scorpio here twice we got air sign here twice um if not three times but yeah devil card i feel like all this shit is balanced out but i'm getting with the page of wands here this person has to travel elsewhere i'm getting they have to disappear okay i'm getting they're gonna have to go into hermit mode for a while or somehow some way shut the fuck up okay or somehow some way they're going to um have to lay low for a while i'm getting uh 
they can't take the heat. They dish it out, but they can't take it. Also, I feel like, like I said, you are in the industry, okay? Whoever this industry person is, I, this could be somebody's A and R, for example. I just heard that. If not, like I said, this is somebody here who's a who's a lone wolf, okay? This is somebody here who's a wolf and she's clothing or a lone wolf. You either catch them by themselves most of the time at events or whatever it is, or um. And somebody who's always by themselves or their roster is always empty or people don't really fuck with this person in the industry. I feel like people know about this person, but you don't know about them. Like I said, this person is actually going to come out and do some type of revengeful shit or this is just what they do. Yeah, spirit of the heart. This person is a very vengeful person here. They know exactly who you are. They love your energy, but, you know, they just don't want anybody else to see you the same way. They know that you are a leader. I'm getting you're, you're worth a damn, okay? You're somebody who's very wholesome. You're very respected, okay? You're recognizable. I feel like you're that motherfucker or you're up and coming. They know that you're being prepared for this here, however, whoever this person is they they don't want people to have the faith in you they don't want people to see you in your true form so this is why they did all that because they don't want to be seen in their true form yeah yeah but i find like despite this person doing that here with the four of wands and the five of wands you still get your stability what you want a job a gig or i'm getting people still fuck with you here you still maintain some type of um relationships or business affairs or whatever it is yeah ace of wands i feel like you still maintain your new ideas and if not or you know your ideas or whatever you have planned or you get new ideas, new clients, new opportunities, you know, new passionate, new beginnings, okay? That's when it's going to be given towards you because a lot of the intentionally tried to cause conflict for you here, but it's because they were competing with you. But this person, I don't feel like this is somebody in the industry or doing the same thing as you. I just feel like this is somebody who sees you as competition and wants to trip you up because you're something they may have wanted to be here or you inspire them, but they don't know how to show that yet. Yeah, Will of Fortune, I feel like your wheels turning in your favor. Nothing ever goes their way. I'm getting with the star card, the high priestess. Yeah, um, spiritual team here. I thought this person also, they could have been an emperor or empress once upon a time or in a past life. But they ruined that or they couldn't heal themselves or they couldn't bounce it back here because they started doing some shit that was very unfavorable here. Also, they could have possibly ruined somebody's marriage or ruined somebody's... um secrets or you know they can't hold water they can't hold water they're always creating drama everywhere they go or they leave a stench or i'm getting a bad taste in people's mouth everywhere they go yeah nine of swords um this this is over with yeah king of cups also what's going on right now let's get into this next pile here for the aquarius if you like that definitely thumbs it up or comment next pile okay so crabs in a bucket mentality here i feel like you could definitely be cleaning up a situation here or you're getting out of you know i feel like every single solution is being presented towards you shit that you thought was going to be long term or whatever it is everything is temporary right now everything is, is switching around getting chess vibes king me like you know that's what's going on all right <coughs> i just sneezed it's clarification confirmation so what's going on right now if you were going through some type of financial hardship here or you were you know um going through something what what is this what what's the energy concerning this here yeah okay so what's going on right now, I feel like you're somebody who's very gifted or people want to do things for you naturally here. I feel like, you know, yeah, you may have had a hard time here, but you're being watched by the spiritual team and by a bunch of other people, people who love you, people who hate you or whatever. But I feel like people want to control you here or they want you to be empty just like them. Like, for example, let's say these are a Dungeness crabs and you're a fucking snow crab. Or you're a king crab or a Japanese crab. Like, you're different than these other motherfuckers. You're not even in the same climate as them. And even if you are, you were never supposed to be here. And I feel like what's going on right now, Um, there could be a situation where somebody here is purposely trying to get you caught up or trapped up. I'm getting, if, you do, if I don't win, you don't win. Somebody wants to control you, control your outcome. But I feel like your ancestors are watching all this shit go down. Watching to see what this person is going to do. It's a test for them. And you as well. Also, um, there could be some type of local news about you i feel like right now everybody is seeing you as snow white one thing about snow white they viewed snow white as somebody who was innocent okay remember the lady who tried to poison her or she was innocent you know the seven dwarves they discovered her and you know uh whatever it's like you're being seen as snow white right now okay you're 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 innocent you're not putting up a fight or i'm getting you know you're not you're an easy competition okay you're an easy competitor at this current time being here you're being saw as an easy competition here but these people who are, are thinking this of you, um, three of wands, I feel like you guys are all looking towards the future and you all have great ideas. But I feel like yours trumps all theirs, but you don't speak up or you don't say anything. Yeah, Six of Cups, I feel like you have to get away from these people here. I'm getting these are people from your from your past or they want to act like they have something to give or offer towards you. But the world card, you definitely need to close out the cycle here. I'm getting you have a big world or a lot of things to actually do. But with the page of coins, these people are actually holding you back here. I'm getting, it's like, they're, they're, you know, you can bring a horse to water, but you can't make them drink. You could be drinking the water here and they're trying to figure out how do you have this. 
yeah two of wands these are, these are motherfuckers here who have also a decision to make here i'm getting you're an easy target but i feel like you have the you you're the most equipped but you are easy target this is what they think of you yes yeah, seven of cups it could also be because you have a lot of options you have a lot of doors open or i'm getting you didn't have it as hard as these people yeah also, people can feel like you're a liar here, or I'm getting you lie about how well equipped or what you know, or somehow you just know everything. But they want to keep you stuck, okay? Um, frozen card, delayed longing. These are my individuals who I'm getting. They don't have any traction unless you have it, but they want to somehow um, manipulate shit. I'm getting don't shine, don't outshine the master. They're trying to use that um status quo or whatever it is on you, but I feel like it's not working. I feel like they want to take advantage of you in some type of way to get to the top. But the only thing is that you know, anytime they try to do this, it will they will fail greatly. Yeah, I feel like the only yeah spirit of the communication. These people are going to be coming towards you to give you some type of loving offers or be cool with you or whatever. Be aware of people who um could possibly be like at work or at home or somehow. These are people here who have the crab in a bucket mentality. You could be from the same place they're from. Okay, small town vibes. Okay, or you could be um going to the same school, same job, same house, same family, same friendship group. You know uh whatever it is, same niche. Same job, same entrepreneurship, same title, whatever the fuck it is. These motherfuckers here, like I said, they all want to use you and abuse you and leave you at the bottom. But it's like they don't have the ability to because their mind does not work like yours. They don't have the skills or things that are equipped like yours here. Like I said, this is only a temporary situation to see what the fuck they're going to do. You will not be stuck in this for long or, you know, it's permanent for them, but it's temporary for you to see what's going on. Yeah, heavy Sagittarius energy throughout this reading. I've seen it like three times, okay? But, um... Like I said, spur of the skills here. These people are karmics here. They're going to get karma if they even try to do anything to you. Five of swords. Because they're waiting to betray you here. Okay. Waiting to put an ending towards you. And three swords to hurt you, kill you, take you out the game. So they didn't pay the swords. They can go back to the other competitors and still battle them out. Because they feel like they're more worthy than you. Um, This could be because they look the same. Or I'm getting they have some type of grit here. But you don't have to really do all that rough and tough shit. I feel like you just be yourself. And, you know, you still beat out the competition. Okay. Um... Yeah, because you have like spiritual helpers or I'm getting the seven dwarves in your Snow White. The seven dwarves are your, your angels, your ancestors, Um, you know, um, your Orishas, if you fuck with them, the most high God, okay? You definitely have your spirit guides and then, you know... um um you know if you if you do if you work with other lingering spirits anything like that you know past your buyers they help you as well too and um that's just period yeah and you have at least one or two people on your side that's the number seven you're having a divine intervention however you know it's being disguised here to see what the fuck they're going to do <sighs> yeah i feel like it's current time being here it's, you're almost ready to spring into action or you're almost ready to be rescued or the situation is about to end however you know you have to you have to let motherfuckers think that you're unequipped you know like for example we have the rabbit and then we also have the we got bambi and we got thumper and then we got the hunter here with the gun okay sort of the armor i feel like you know like i said you have the gun these motherfuckers ain't got shit this deer has fucking horns but they're on fire this bunny don't really got nothing going on i mean speed but Shit, look like it's on fire over there. Yeah. Like I said, Spirit of the Clover, we have Sleeping Beauty right here. Abundance is yours, luck is yours, money is yours here. I find this is a situation to somehow build inner strength with you here. Or somehow show you how bad or how, how bad people want shit, but somehow they're still not equipped. Also, Page of Cups is also showing you how to have more faith here. Or showing you, like, you know, even by yourself, you're still very strong despite having these two people working together. Yeah, I feel like Ten of Cups, you give yourself only, you, you give yourself your own emotional stability or you don't need anybody else. Okay? Yeah, with the Nine of Cups and the Knight of Swords, I feel like also you can fight these motherfuckers off. I'm getting, you're going to get what you want here. You can weather the storm. And then we have the furthest thing, playing by Drake, okay? I'm getting, you stay down, okay? Like, you know, you do that, okay? That's one thing about you. You're very resilient, all Aquarius. But Ace of Cups, you'll be having a new opportunity here. I'm getting Two of Pentacles. Them two juggling, they will either have to juggle themselves or, you know, um, how do you say, let them fight each other. You just keep them moving, okay? Yeah, whoever these signs are, this could be a, a e the people involved here, either somebody's an air sign or a fire sign here, heavy air sign, heavy fire sign vibes, okay, we don't have any really air signs like that. Also, what's going on, um, for some of you guys here, there's going to be a clear solution presenting itself, so you're going to find out somebody is abusing some type of child here, or either somebody's abusing a child, either you're not seeing that somebody's child is being abused here, or, um... I feel like you're going to find out somebody's abusing their child. 
Yeah. Or somebody's not seeing things clearly because of their their uh their childhood abuse. What is this? Not seeing things clearly. Yeah, I feel like somebody's not want to um, run back home or somebody's not want to return to their childhood home or I'm getting relived the moments in their head of their childhood. Yeah, whoever this person is, I feel like they carry a lot of burdens, but they're able to transmute these. This could definitely be a feminine, a, a female, somebody's in a feminine energy um, or earth sign or a water sign here. But whoever this person is, I feel like they're bad news. I'm getting like, you know, um, they have a hard time looking at their past. But I feel like whatever they're not seeing clearly, what is this? Yeah, hyphen card. This could be, um, okay, so the ancestors are trying to show them, you know, how do you say to be strong, to be armor filled, to be decided. I'm getting to decide on something here, but th this person don't know what they want. I'm getting, yeah, we have the child abuse card, but why do we have that here? Why do we have the child abuse card? That's something that I'm wondering about. Queen of, Queen of, uh, what is this, wands and the knight of wands? Yeah, I feel like this is regarding somebody's past. This could be your past or somebody else's. But with the Nine of Swords here, I honestly feel like... What the Innocence is trying to do right now, this is a temporary situation, okay? I mean, you could be one through one of these or you know somebody else or, you know, whatever it is. Temporary situation here. Somebody is refusing to definitely do some type of shadow work or look back at their trauma or whatever abuse, uh, uh, child abuse moments or whatever happened to them as a child. And you're being told to do this. But I feel like with the Queen of Swords, excuse me, the Queen of Wands and the Knight of Wands, somebody rather just think they have it all together and, you know, um, come in with all this information. I'm getting like somebody's not really want to dig up things. Also, there could be some type of files here that somebody's going to find out regarding their childhood or abuse. So I'm getting things that you forgot about your childhood or things that you don't remember that happened towards you because somebody blocked it out or you blocked it out. Either somebody's going to be sharing these things with you or you're going to be sharing these things with somebody or you're going to remember this. Or it could be a child in your family, okay? Or your actual child, but nine of swords. I'm like, somebody's about to go through some type of um, um, sleepless nights, anxiety, sorrow, or, you know, some type of recollection here because there's going to be a part of the brain here that's going to be unlocked somebody has not i'm getting whatever it is motherfuckers ain't remember this shit i'm getting like this will be a nightmare because somebody really does not remember any of these things that happened towards them this could possibly be you aquarius okay or you know somebody else because I feel like somebody wants something here. They can't make a decision on what they want or what's being presented towards them. So spiritual, so the spirit guys, you know, the answers, they saying like, look, I didn't want to have to do you like this, but this is the only way, you know, it's giving tough love vibes. This is the only way to, for you to uh, satisfy your wants and your needs or to see what you want here. Yeah, Aquarius. I feel like whoever this person is, magician card, somebody's manifesting a queen of cups. Could be like, you know, manifesting, you know, being a mother or, you know, being like, you know, uh, having it all together, you know, being a businessman, a businesswoman, you know, um, being very emotional, calm, cool, collected, clean, nice, you know, um, shit like that. But we have a queen of cups. So this could be regarding two females or something a female did to somebody. Somebody could be in a feminine energy. And this is regarding a queen of pentacles. Somebody here who could have been a mother. Somebody who knows their worth. Or somebody here who did something to them and then we have the king of coins so this could be a mother and a father here and then we have the knight of coins mother father and a sibling here and this is some type of betrayal that definitely happened here whatever this betrayal was it put somebody on the right path somebody had to relocate or move here all right or somebody had to travel i'm getting to go live with somebody else or whatever it is and then i have diamonds dancing okay by uh future and drake plan so I'm getting somebody to dance around the situation. People act like it never happened. But King of Wands, this could be like an uncle or somebody here who knows it happened. The masculine energy. Ace of Wands. Yeah. Seven of Wands. In order to cross your teeth and dot your eyes, you got to go through this. Six of Wands. I found the sword and the stone. This is your justice. But in order, you have to get yourself unstuck or you have to defeat your mind. Or something like that here. Somebody's going to have to do that here. Okay, in order to get the right solution, or in order to get their mind right. I feel like whatever this is, ooh, shit. Whatever this is, okay, this is going to leave somebody heartbroken or shaking or, you know, go through some type of emotional trauma. Yeah, this, this is all regarding somebody who was like a, a family friend or a companion or somebody here that they, they thought that they really fucked with here. But when they open up this book, it's going to really intoxicate somebody or make somebody drink or smoke heavily or they could possibly do this already or you do. But I feel like, it, you know, it may pick up. 
yeah this is something that's very serious it's definitely some type of old rotten shit it's about some type of sly ass behavior betrayal okay and that's the truth what is this about let me have and it's gonna be some shocking news or it's gonna be shocking this even happened to somebody here or shocking like wow that all that sh that bad stuff happened to me and not close it out i never remember yeah we got wale here so that could be a significance the song by wale lotus flower bomb this shit is gonna be a bomb tick tick boom yeah what a card do we have money shower from the divine but like i said this is going to come with a money shower this is going to come with a great blessing or a great reward from the divine okay for the most high the universe and shit but first this is going to be one uphill battle i'm getting this is going to be something that's going to be temporary but boys they're going to eat somebody up if you ever seen the movie snowfall or excuse me the tv show snowfall and he took that uh acid and he had the ego death it's going to be something like that but it's going to come in hot and heavy and quick okay yeah yeah, but I'm getting somebody has to keep their head up here through it all. Somebody has to stay mentally strong or whatever this is. Once you get through it here, you'll be mentally stronger, strong as ever. I'm getting I robot. Nothing can shake you. Or you're you're really hard to be shakable. But yeah, whack. Yeah, I feel like because you've been wearing a mask for a long time and you realize all this because of all this whack shit that happened to worse you. I'm getting it's whack to really be wearing this mask. Here's time, you know, you've had time, but now we're going to show you tough love and you got to get through it. Yeah, little petite, likes petite things. This could be something that happened to somebody as a child. Okay, there was abuse. I'm getting somebody's mother was fake or somebody's mother or feminine energy knew about this here. They tried to downplay it or whatever it was in the house. Some type of nightmare, some type of terrible what is happened to somebody here. Okay, something could also be regarding the stairs, the basement here or something here that is unforgivable. And somebody did, and I just heard, how can you live with yourself? Okay, Drake just said that on the TV. Yeah, it's like somebody was a trickster here and used somebody to be somebody. I feel like you were the individual. Whoever this is was going through this, they're weak, okay? Or they were a follower of Clueless or whatever's going on, okay? And this, whatever this was done here was unforgivable because somebody happened to this at a, ch as a child age, all right? But, um, y'all, yeah, this is the reading. I'm not even going to go that deep, okay? But this is what it is. Like this video, comment down below, and subscribe. I will definitely see you all later. Bye.